Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. Today I have a brand new release. This is at Vance from Ellen Villa from the Prime Power Collection in the color Nut Brown Rooted. I'd like to thank Wig Studio One for providing Advance to me, for our review for all of you. Actually, it was provided so I could review it for the Wig Studio One YouTube channel, and I chose to review it for you as well. I know, hear me out, I understand these Prime Power collections are have a higher price point, but let me talk to you a little bit, not only about the style and why I love it, but also about the benefits of having this human hair HD synthetic blend. I also would like to let you know that I have three others. I just ordered two other um, new styles from this collection. I think they are beautiful. Let's talk a little bit about the benefits and I will leave a timestamp down below if you want to skip on over to the to the review of advance but i thought i'd start out with the benefits the first thing is as i mentioned this is a blend of hd fibers and synthetic blend there it's a 40 percent human hair 60 percent uh hd fibers while they are have a higher price point than a regular synthetic they are considerably less than a human hair as far as the longevity, while uh, if we take a, an HD fiber and we wear it every day, it may last three months. With this blend, we're looking at up to a year, maybe even longer. I've had my catch for over a year. I have worn it lots, but with proper care, it can last a year or longer. So there is one of the benefits for sure. The other benefit is this looks and feels like real hair. It it just it feels like the hair I had all through the years of growing up. You could run your fingers through them. The other nice thing is you're not going to have the tangles that we find with the HD fibers. With HD, you know how, how it tangles a bit uh, around the nape? You're not going to find that. The tangling is less on these fibers. When uh, on the Facebook page, on the private Facebook group with Studio One, we're going to support group, we have lots of members that take their HD synthetic fibers and they'll clip a piece of human hair um, extension, if you will, a human hair piece. They'll, they'll attach it to the nape in order to prevent any tangling or to diminish the tangling. With the Prime Power, we have a really nice blend so that human hair is not going to allow the, the tangling as we find in just a straight synthetic. The other thing is the uh, humidity and the reaction to the environment. I've had, I live in Florida, as many of you know, and when I wear a human hair piece or when I've worn a human hair piece in the past, the humidity has just frizzed it. It has frizzed that human hair, but you're not going to find that on this blend. It's not going to react to the environment as we find in the human hair. With this blend, we also don't have to apply as much styling. We have a memory, it's called memory styling. If I added, I haven't done anything to this one. I just took it out of the box. I recorded the review for Wix Studio One and now I'm recording the review for you. So I haven't done anything. I just ran the comb through it. That was it. It doesn't have any products or anything like that. This is just how it arrived right out of the box. But with uh, many styles, as we, we add the curls, for example, to the wig, we're going to have to add it again. With this prime blend or with this the styles from the prime power you could add curls you don't have to hold it up as we would with a heat friendly fibers where we have to hold the curl and in order for it and allow it to cool with this uh, blend you can if you want a very tight curl you can pin it but if you just want some loose waves you could just use your curling iron with the heat up to no higher than 300 degrees Fahrenheit and the curl will stay. When you wash it, you could wash it six, seven times. You're going to have the same style. And if you want to bring it back to a straight style, just add heat again and it's going to 
remain that way as well. We have less shine as we do with than we do on regular synthetic. This is, I haven't added anything as I mentioned, and you'll see when I go outside and show you the color, you'll see that there is absolutely no shine. So that is another plus that we have. And the care is going to be just the same as we have, as we have with any of our other wigs. We're going to wash every six to eight wears, and I'm going to attach a picture up here of the products that we want to use on the power blend, on the pa prime power on these blends. It's really, they are for human hair wigs, but that's what we want to use on these. Wash them every six to eight wears. You don't have to blow dry. If you want to blow dry, you can do so at a medium heat. Overall, I think these fibers are amazing. They are my favorite because of their longevity, because of the feel. It just feels like my hair. Advanced weighs 4.75 ounces. So we have, it, it sounds as if we have a lot of hair here, but in actuality, it's, I would say it's uh, less than average. I, when I run my hands through it, what I am feeling is my head. The um, permatease is minimal. The density is less than average. The permatease, actually, it's almost non-existent. You, we, when I show you the cap, you'll see it's, it's really no density on there. Uh, even at the crown, we have a very sleek piece but enough of a density that we're not going to have a very flat look in my opinion. All right, let's go now to the to the review of Advance. We have a front of 11 inches, so we have really pretty face framing layers. The crown is 16 inches, the sides are 13.25 inches, the nape is 18, no, I'm sorry. The nape is 13.75 inches. We do have a long piece. I would say that advance is right around the 20, 22 inch from the crown all the way down. And if we want to tuck it, we can certainly tuck it because our density is relatively low. Let me show you the lace front. Um, this color, not brown rooted, it is 12, 830, and a nine. So we do have a darker root and therefore we do have a bit of knotting, but that is typical of any of any wig that, that has rooting, a very dark rooting on it or most styles. I have very good coverage. Here is the ear tab. And here is my hairline. As far as the fit, I have a 21 and a half inch circumference and advance fit me perfectly. I just attended a webinar by Ellen Villa where they were explaining about the different fibers and everything about this, this new collection. And the trainer has a 22 and a half inch circumference. She was actually wearing advance during our training and it fit her fine and it's because this cap although it's a weft cap it is covered with a material kind of like what we may find on leggings so there's lots of stretch i had to cinch mine in in order to accommodate my 21 and a half inch circumference and it is labeled as a petite average but I did want to mention that it will fit up to a 22 and a half inch circumference. But Nut Brown Rooted is 12, 8, 30, and 9. This is a light and medium brown blended with a light auburn and a darker root. This is a warm brunette. I think it is beautiful. It, the You're not going to have any stark highlights. You're not go or obvious highlights. The color is beautifully, beautifully blended with the three colors. And that darker root just blends down. So we have a gorgeous color just going through. We have a left part. And as you can see, it's done very nicely. 
very well. I will probably add a bit of scar tape there. All right, let's take a look at this cap. We have an extended lace front, and even though we have a left mono part, we do have some nice soft material here. This is tulle, and it's doubled, very, very soft. So why Ellen Villa did this is in order to provide a more comfortable fit. If you have um, hair loss, if you have no hair, if you have a sensitive scalp, this top mono will be very comfortable for you. The wefts, as I mentioned, are covered with a very soft material. So it is allowing stretch, lots of stretch as we find in leggings, but it is very soft. So you won't have any of that. If you, many wearers have a sensitive scalp and those wefts are bothersome. So you're not going to find that on these. We have felt covered ear tabs. We have an extended nape and we have Velcro adjusters. If you want to wear it back in a ponytail, you can do that. And the ponytail is very, very thin. And that's due to the lower density that we have or the average density. You could bring it up and put it up in a messy bun. By far my favorite fibers. I love, I absolutely love the hair power collection from Ellen Villa and these prime blends. I love everything about it. Uh, I, I only have good things to say about them and no, it wasn't because it was sent to me because I, you know, that I tell you the truth. Plus, if I didn't love it so much, I wouldn't have purchased two other ones. So when I, I received this one for the review and when I felt it and I looked at it, I thought, okay, this is just as beautiful as my catch. I need two other ones. So stay tuned for those reviews. Thank you, everyone. Please let me know what you think about the Prime uh, Power Collection. Let me know what you think about this combination this blend of these fibers. I would love to hear from you. Uh, I just feel that you just can't beat the longevity and the feel and the look of these fibers. I think they're perfection. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day and I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye.